I'd like to uh, close by introducing the uh, interim president and CEO of Merit Network, Mike McPherson, um, who's going to give us some nice closing words. Um, I want to thank Mike personally for getting involved in NANOG, um, in, in the NANOG features discussion, and for putting up with a bunch of geeks who don't know the meaning of the word tact. <laughs> Wait okay. a minute. Don't I get to be a geek too? Okay. <laughs> I, I get to be a geek too. There was, there was a day when I was a geek. I sort of remember. Um, uh, thanks. I have the sad duty of uh, bringing Nanog 34 to a close. Uh, I also have the very happy duty of saying good things about a whole lot of people who made this meeting very successful. And that's always a lot of fun. Uh, I'd like to start by, by thanking our host for, the, for Nanog 34, Switch and Data. Uh, they have put tremendous uh, resources and effort into making this a success, particularly Chris Caseta, Jennifer Dapko, and Duncan Elliott. Are you here? You want to stand up and take a round of applause? So if you get a chance, please say thanks to these folks for all of the work that they've done, all the support for Nanog. Uh, also, I'd like to thank uh, EtherQuest for their uh, support with the network. Jeff Turner, Anthony Smith, and Pablo Zurita. Uh, are you here? If they're here, they're not going to take credit for it. OK. Uh, multicast services were provided by Joel Yegley and Lucy Lynch of the University of Oregon. Okay. Uh, DNS, DHCP, and web caching come to you from Dwayne Wessels of Packet Pushers. Dwayne. I guess they're all off ten tending servers. And uh, jack of all trades, I'm told, and wireless help from uh, Matt Weaver of Table 23. Uh, of course, uh, we're all feeling good about our breaks, uh, sponsored by Force 10. So if you get a chance to say thanks to a Force 10 person, please do. Thank you. Also, I'm told, uh, sadly, I wasn't able to be here, but I'm told that Beer and Gear was a great success. Uh, please think kindly of the Beer and Gear sponsors as you're moving forward into the future. Thanks to all of them. Uh, of course, uh, the Merit folks. There are a lot of Merit folks here this week who make things happen. Sue Joyner, Carol Wadsworth, David Gilbertson, stand up if you're here. Betty Burke, already standing. Jason Russell, Don Kahn, Larry Blunk, Chris Frazier, and Susan Harris, of course. Thanks to all of them for all of the hard work. <laughs> Tremendous effort goes into getting ready for this. Uh, also, Speaking of effort, Steve Feldman and the program committee. Uh, this is a huge amount of work to put together a quality program for NANOG, and, uh, and these folks did a great job. Uh, also, thanks to all of the speakers who uh, worked hard on this. So for the program, thank you, Steve, and the program committee and the speakers. Uh, the uh, email administration team. Uh, it deserves thanks, Martin Hannigan and the, uh, and, and the email administration team who have discovered that uh, this is quite a task. Uh, so thanks to them for all of their hard work. I'd like also to, to say thanks to all of the Merit staff who don't come to Nanog. There are a bunch of folks back in Ann Arbor who, uh, who put in a, a tremendous amount of effort uh, behind the scenes. So all of you stand up and wave at the camera, or wave at your screens. Actually, I'm waving at the camera. So thanks to the Merit folks at home. And finally, stand up because you're leaving anyway. Stand up, give yourself a big round of applause. It's, it's all of you who make Nanog uh, both necessary and possible and make it a great thing. So thanks, everybody. Uh, Nanog 34 has been a success, and I think that's a wrap. <laughs>